This is the energy vibration reading for um, the um, ninth week of the year 2018. And I want to say to each and every one, thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. It is a wonderful, wonderful um, sort of energy that is coming in. Okay, um, this week... Um, it's going to be the week of judgment, week of a lot of secrets, a lot of things coming out that wasn't um, known. So um, it's going to be really um, a week of a lot of a lot of things coming out. The zodiac energy is water. Okay, so let's look at your week for you, Gemini. So we calling up the angels and guides. On Monday, um, you have the energy of the Eye Princess. Um, it's good because it's in the um, the week of judgment, the week of um, all the secrets. Because this is a card of um, secrets. There's a lot of secrets, um, and these secrets are going to be coming out. So, um, this is the energy of um, the Eye Princess, and the Eye Princess comes up with. Um, Wonderful sort of an energy in the sense that um, it is letting you know, or you know, it makes you be aware of certain aspects and certain things that is happening in your life, okay? And things that you weren't aware of. Tuesday, you have the Eight of Pentacles, you're working very hard. A lot of you, um, hair sign people, are having this eight energy which is infinity abundant but just still um, you're working hard on things it's as if uh, um, your inner wisdom and guidance is guiding you and pushing you towards um, something that is um, very wonderful very positive and very good so whatever the situation is of was this is going to be happening for you and you're going to have a plain understanding of whatever the situation was and whatever that was um, transpiring okay then we move on and we're looking at Wednesday Wednesday a new new um, beginning this new beginning is in work for some people this new beginning can also be um, just something new is happening in your life which is positive and it's it has to do with work because this new beginning is going to somehow balance out your financial situation so whatever that has been happening for you this new beginning is going to bring a brand new start in your life which is going to bring positive wonderful thing in your life and this is all about work and it could be um, that your inner wisdom and guidance is pushing you towards um, starting to work for yourself or starting to look within to find um, a way of you you know working for yourself or doing this sort of a thing or um, pushing you um, to develop new skills and um, pushing you to find out if there you know if there's something else that you weren't aware that you have that you could develop and this is this is one of those wonderful energies on Thursday you have the wheel of fortune you have the wheel of fortune so this is good so you have the wheel of fortune on Thursday which is wonderful this is crowned in your week um, this is a wonderful energy to be crowned in your week so this is going to be extremely extremely good wheel of fortune brings a lot of good luck and um, whenever this situation comes up this means that um, whatever your situation was before the secrets or whatsoever because it's a week where a lot of secrets are going to be coming out so um, whatever your position was before these secrets coming out it's going to bring forward positive energy but depends on what kind of energy you're giving out because that's what is going to be rolling in your life but the, the um the wheel of fortune and you it's just so brilliant it's so just so wonderful okay we're going for, oh. isn't this wonderful so you Gemini's are having fun um, 
a positive energy positive energy because um, whatever that is coming out this week is gonna be good because you are going to um, you are going to overcome whatever there was whatever that people whatever that was transpiring you're gonna overcome this and it's gonna be good um, you're gonna be the um, victoriously coming out of this and moving forward um, for some people you're going to be starting a battle and we're going to see if you're going to win that battle because um, sometimes secrets come out and things that you thought oh my god I can't believe this and you know it's not gonna I'm not gonna stand for this and this sort of a thing and um, because the energy of the high princess is actually showing you what is going on so let's see <gasps> There we go with the intellectual. Uh, you have used the intellectual, the communication. This is another ace. This is wonderful. This is powerful. This is good because you are using the communication and your interaction. And this is two big victory beside each other because whatsoever that has transpired whatever the secrets that was kept and that sort of a thing this is too big victory behind each other that is coming up to let you know that um you know you have come over these obstacles these obstacles that were set in your way is going to be removed and um you're going to be extremely extremely successful with this endeavor and then the last energy oh my god <laughs> oh my god okay wonderful oh my gosh you Gemini's um, wonderful you Gemini's um, this is good this is positive extremely extremely positive so you are leaving a situation behind because you have um, win um, win the situation you have overcome the situation and you're leaving a situation behind which is um, wonderful it's positive whatever that was playing out whatever that was transpiring you are walking away and you're leaving the situation behind and you're moving on to better shores in your life and this is going to be good okay so it's a wonderful week because whatever secrets whatever that has been transpiring in your life whatever um, situation that has happened in your life you are seeing the wonderful positive energies okay so as we look at the first half of the week <laughs> as we look at the first half of the week we're seeing the energy of the eye princess comes comes up okay um, we see the energy of the high princess comes up and the eye princess comes up um, and it's helping you um, to find balance in your work life um, which is good it's helping you to find um, balance in your work life and um, this is very good so um, she comes up and is trying to move you and trying to find, help you to find balance in your work life and this is all about things coming out and things um, helping you to move forward things are here because um, uh, you know if the last or um, there is a section in the week where there is going to be um, the ace of wands the ace of swords and the ace of Pentacles and I'm, I'm going to show you how this is because um, this is a positive reading whenever all the three aces comes out in a reading with the wheel of fortune and the chariot okay you Gemini's this week is going to be good it's gonna be extremely good um, so we have one major two major orcana and they're um, I, I'm lining up um, exactly um, with each other so we have the eye princess and eye princess is bringing out secrets because it's the week of uh, um, judgment and she's bringing out secrets and whatever these secrets are you are going to win whatever is transpiring around you whatever um, that has transpired before because you you have worked hard and you're working hard to make sure that this happens and this is going to be happening for you okay middle of the week 
as we look at the middle of the week um, the situation that is happening is that you have the energy of the eight of Pentacles and the energy of the eight of Pentacles with um, the energy of and, 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 and victory um, the ace of sword and the ace of one okay so um, whatever that has happened whatever that has transpired this is this is heavenly this is wonderful because there is now um, a sort of a situation that is happening um, in your life where you're overcoming there's new beginnings and you have overcome um, whatever that was transpiring and there is going to be a solid new beginning for you and this is going to be good now I'm holding out these cards because there's something that I want you to see this is how these three cards line up in your reading so you have the energy of the ace of one then the ace of swords and the ace of pentacles so you're finishing off the week Sunday with the ace of pentacles and this is going to be extremely wonderful because it is it has the energy of the wheel of fortune with the ace of pentacles so obviously um, the wheel of fortune is going to bring you a lot of money there is going to be a victorious successful um, ending to whatever that is happening and whatever that has transpired it's as if you went in a situation um, where now you're seeing that justice has prevailed and you're moving um, out of a situation because you have a new beginning um, the ace of Pentacles and then the wheel of fortune so what this is saying is that um, there is coming a new beginning um, in your world with the energy of the ace of um, um, Pentacles so this wheel of fortune is going to bring you a lot of money in your life so let's see what is um, the um, future the point the middle point from the first half of the week it's about all about love all about love it's all about love it's all about loving yourself it's all about connecting with your twin flame or soulmate this is going to be happening for you um, this connection um, is going to be coming in a lot of people are going to be connecting with your twin flame or soul flame in the beginning of the week because the eye princess is here and it's as if the eye prince is working together with the chariot to bring you both together it's as if um, she's making sure that whatever secrets whatever that was going on that is all going to come out in the hair and whenever it comes out in the hair um, then there is a clear up of whatever event and situation that was happening and um, this is going to be um, extremely extremely positive so wonderful energies for you guys um, this is a powerful week for you guys then you have the Prince of Pentacles the Prince of Pentacles this is someone um, between the ages of 25 and 45 and in the middle of the week um, whatever that was transpiring um, was a, um, um, a, the, is, as if um, you had to deal with this Prince of Pentacles whoever this person was and it's this person is between the ages of 25 and, and 40 and here you have here you are trying to work and figure out things and trying to um, you know um, place and balance out certain aspects and certain things and whoever this person is you have victoriously overcome whatever the situation because it can be um, a man yet still it's a woman but it is someone who is between the ages of 25 and 45 it could be and um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn okay but whoever this person is you know you have worked so hard and you know you have overcome whatever obstacles that this person was placing in and you're moving away and that is good and the last energy oh my god happiness oh my gosh you guys are having such such a wonderful a wonderful um, week this is a powerful reading a powerful week that is coming up you have the lovers and you have happiness the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are coming out 
and your wishes and dreams are placed in the last part of the week where you have a new beginning that is coming in and this new beginning is with your, um, your financial situation and the wheel of fortune is going to be turning in um, your favor and this is going to be good because you have happiness so that is letting you know that um, um, that is letting you know that um, love happiness and joy and um, the nine of cups is here and this is going to be very positive so it's gonna be a very um, a wonderful positive week because with all these um, the ace of one you um, have victoriously overcome a situation with um, the knight of Pentacles and um, this is um, a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn and um, by doing that what transpire in your life is that happiness and joy comes out because um, of this big win this happiness and joy comes out and you are moving forward in a wonderful positive way in your life and this is going to be the good this is this is really 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 um, a really um, positive positive reading because what is transpiring here is that the universe is conspiring to make something happen in your life and this is going to be good um, love um, love is going to be wonderful for you guys because in the beginning of the week a lot of you are going to be connecting with your twin flame or soul flame or connecting with these wonderful energies you're ending the week also on a powerful note of uh, happiness the nine of cups so um, with the wheel of fortune this is good good news is coming your way so this is going to be extremely wonderful so um, let's see um, the um, message from the universe for you guys um, this week is this energy okay isn't it beautiful yeah I love 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 these cards um, psst, it's me again the universe you deserve more you know much more try this stop trying to predict and therefore limit where it goes or it comes out just know it's going to come and let me figure out the rest okay so if somebody out there is asking for something and you're pushing and wondering when is it gonna come if it's gonna happen am I going to meet the quota and that's all no let it go let it go because what is going to happen is that um, you're limiting yourself towards what the universe would have sent something better but you're limiting um, yourself so um, stop limiting yourself and wait because it's going to be happening for you guys okay all right if you have a question and you but uh, um, you have a question for this week and um, just make a request and the angel answers is here it's gonna help you out in the near future isn't that wonderful yeah in the near future means like within three weeks okay in the near future means within three weeks or um, maybe later on in the day or that sort of a thing so congratulations and I want to say namaste and please remember to listen to your sun moon horizon sign namaste until next time